absolutely hate about me. Hi, I'm Goof. So the other day I was chilling out, just watching some YouTube videos with Bees Trigger 73, and I was asking Bees Trigger 73, what's your favorite type of content on YouTube? And he told me, I've been recently watching some Nguyen YouTube videos, and they go mighty hard in the paint. Also, Dumpy. When are you gonna suck me? So anyways, I took a look at Anguin's YouTube channel and something caught my eye, okay? Brent Rivera is mad zesty. As I'm sure most of you guys watching this video already know, I have extensive history with Brent Rivera. I think this might be video number 13. You could say I'm obsessed, I mean... Yeah, I, I definitely am. But Anguin inspired me to make today's video, and I was also inspired by fellow colleague Keed Boy to check out Brent Rivera becoming a cheerleader. Brent Rivera, cheers. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you guys enjoyed the video so much that you feel inclined to perhaps maybe in the future watch more videos, subscribe. Also, leave a comment. Let's begin. Oh! oh. No, I'm going home. Oh, oh my god! Help me now jump! Yeah. What a weird fucking intro. Oh my god, the cheerleaders are spinning and doing stuff they've been practicing for their entire lives flawlessly. In real life, we're seeing it with our own eyes. Intro. And then his girlfriend's like, I'm going home. Obviously, I can't really talk shit because Brent Rivera is the number one YouTuber on the entire planet, Mr. Beast 2. But, I will say this. Um... That's it. Do you think Brent Rivera eats dogs? All right, so we snuck into Lexi's room and- Okay, is anyone surprised? Brent's weird infatuation with just sneaking around and getting into, uh, inside Lexi? What's going on there, man? What the fuck? First second of the video. Hey, so we're sneaking into my sister's room. Anyone think that's a little bit odd? You're just mad, Dumpy. They're just an innocent brother and sister who spreads the one another open for Target in the YouTube video. Yeah, Dumpy, you're the weird one for bringing this up and making some kind of insinuations. Not Brent, the person who physically did the action and posted it on YouTube. We stole a ton of her stuff and we put it inside this vending machine. So Lex is going to have to buy back all of her stuff. We stole my sister's underwear and shoved it up a vending machine so that she has to buy it back. This is such... An epic prank. <laughs> Sorry, Lexi. <laughs> She's been looking for her car keys all day and look. Okay, obviously we all know it's just bullshit for a YouTube video, but that would be the most inconvenient thing of all time if it was genuinely real. But it's fake as fuck. And also, why did his boyfriend, Brent Rivera's boyfriend, why did he say this like this? <laughs> Sorry, Lexi. I'm just sort of picking up on the vibe that this dude, let's call him Paulo Bombo. I think that Paulo Bombo has had clitoral interactions with Lexi. B1 to get her car keys back. <laughs> yeah, no way of getting here. She had to walk to the house. <laughs> <laughs> that was the laugh of someone who has $50 million in their checking account. What? Oh my god! I was literally just complaining about this! Lexi Rivera sounds like a mosquito that won't leave you alone in the wilderness in 2007. I'm about to do an impression of Lexi Rivera and let me know in the comments below if it's actually me doing an impression or if I'm just inputting her own audio. Oh my god! Uh, it was just really the same thing about this! Uh, let me know what you guys think. Hey, Andrew stole all I was your looking stuff. for my car key and my perfume and my brush. Wait, I just have Wait a minute. Did she just say her... her... Her bra? My bra. Okay, so it turns out that Brent Rivera and his boy toy managed to steal not a lower undergarment fabric covering, but instead a upper fabric covering. Brent Rivera, is he a sicko for this? I'm leaning towards yes. I just don't know what your guys' opinion is on this though, but if it's different than mine right now, don't worry, I'll I'll change it. Whatever you guys want. I'm kidding, by the way. Question though, why the hell do you have handcuffs in your room? <laughs> that was the most guilty laugh of all time. We all know the real reason why there's handcuffs in there. We all know the real events that transpire with those handcuffs between man and woman. I need to chill out, dude. These are jokes, okay? Please don't take me to court. Wait, those aren't the ones that were in my room, are they? <laughs> Funny, now give me my stuff back. No, you have to buy it back, Lexi. Not. I'm not gonna buy my own stuff back. Does this make you happy? Yes, sir. Wait, Lexi was a man this whole time? That explains so much. B7. Oh, you went for your hat. <gasps> oh, it got sucked. Oh my god! 
it got stuck. <laughs> I have an idea. Where are you going? I'll be right back. Wait, what Drew. The what Wait, what are you doing? What's going? Oh! oh my God. No, that's like a serious uh, health risk hazard. What if Lexi steps on the glass? No. Stop, make it stop, no. Brent definitely did not think that through. I think Brent has little siblings. What if they're like, oh Brent, where's my money for candy? And then they step on the glass, rip their feet open. They always hate Brent. They win a lawsuit against Brent at five years old to get half of his earnings. These are all genuine things that could very much happen in real life. Or maybe I'm just being too dramatic and it's fake glass. It's like candy glass, sugar glass. Maybe it's that. Maybe, you know, Brent Rivera, he's so loaded. He's got so much saved up in the back end that he can just install a candy glass fake vending machine specifically to be smashed for a video. Real glass or fake glass, let me know. <laughs> you broke my vending machine! Oh no, how is Brent Rivera gonna survive in today's uh, landscape? How is he gonna make it? Oh my gosh. He was supposed to make return on his investment with that vending machine, and then his friend just destroyed it, and now he's gonna be homeless, begging for money, begging for Chuck E. Cheese coin. <laughs> I need you to put these on. Oh. <laughs> how are we supposed to fit in this? Oh, this is gonna be a lot of fun. Notice how all of Brent's fans were completely opposed to the idea initially of putting this on. How are we gonna fit into this? Oh my gosh. And then Brent says, it's gonna be so much fucking fun. I think we can all tell who wants to go down this uh, pipeline. The core muscle! Yeah. I'm not what? gonna be able to do that. Yeah. I am not that flexible. Oh. I cannot. <laughs> Um, that right there, how was that right there, Brent? That right there. That right there makes me actually want to go copyright strike. Um, great. Oh. Oh. All right, so what are we gonna start off with? Just some easy tumbling. Oh, cool. Oh. Why is Brent Rivera collaborating with cheerleaders other than the obvious fact of him making this video, but like what drove him to make this video? I assume when you conquer YouTube so hard like uh, Drake, sorry, like Brent does, I'm sure that you eventually run out of ideas and maybe someone who works for him, like his manager or his assistant or his secretary, they came to him with this idea and he just ran with it and it obviously made him thousands of dollars. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. All right, so who wants to go first? Uh, uh, I'll go. Let Let's go, Don. Let's go. Woo! I don't think he even tried, man. If I was one of the cheerleaders, that would make a mockery out of me, dude. Put in 100%. Even if you fall on your face, break your neck, and you're out forever, like that's it, GG. Put in 100%, dude. Uh, Oh, that's way harder than it looks. How do you do? That, was that right there, that's the part of the video where they lie to the camera to keep that good working relationship with Brent Rivera. No, I'm joking. I don't know why they said that. It was Cheeks. Oh, 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 oh. That was better. I think it was better. What do you mean that was better? He totally just fell and made an embarrassment out of himself in front of six million people. LOL, oh my gosh. It's all over for him. So guys, if this video gets 352,000 likes, I'm gonna live with my ex-girlfriend Ava for 24 hours. Oh my God. What kind of like goal is 352,000 likes? Is this guy made out of the Monopoly man? If y'all enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe. I do think that Brent Rivera could be the number one cheerleader in the world.